question to you. Success or contribution? As I said, the two are not necessarily mutually exclusive, but sometimes you are compelled to choose. What will you choose? Let me give you an example. Have you heard of Jimmy Wales? He stated his vision in an interview with Slashdot in 2004 and said, imagine a world in which every single person on the planet is given free access to the sum total of human knowledge. That's what we are doing. Do you know what I'm talking about? Have you heard of Wikipedia? Jimmy Wales is the founder of Wikipedia. But that's not why I'm mentioning him here. I'm mentioning him here because he is an example of the choice that I mentioned between success, which is fame, popularity, money, and significance and contribution. Imagine what the value is of the quantity and quality of information contained in Wikipedia. Imagine how much money the founder could have made if he had followed the usual startup, build, acquire trajectory. But what did Jimmy Wales do? He formed a nonprofit and secured Wikipedia for all the people of the world so that they could have free access to any information they may need. What could have been the net worth of Jimmy Wales if he had decided to monetize Wikipedia? He's not exactly starving to death, but he could have done many things with Wikipedia, which would have made him humongously wealthy and powerful. Instead, he chose to give it away to those who needed the most, students, researchers, children, and anyone in search of knowledge on any subject on earth. Success or contribution? As I said, the two are not always mutually exclusive, but sometimes we must make a choice. Today, we want to focus on our youth and develop leadership. I ask you to think of what you mean by leadership. Success, money and fame, or significance and contribution. 